Masai is a journey and that's how we see it. People come to Israel for a few months to a year to embrace in the society, to live it like a local so they become part of us and who we are. They, uh, they, they learn more about Israel, connect to their Jewish identity and learn more about themselves while they're here. They come here to intern, to volunteer, to teach or to study. But in any way, the most, the, when the time that they're here, they're getting to know more Israel, and Israel will always be part of them, even if they decide to stay here or to go back to their community. Masai is, is, is a journey for the 12,000 participants that uh, come to Israel and have a special uh, Israeli experience that uh, will shape their life in many years to come. Uh, they contribute to the country on the one hand, but they are being contributed as well by the country. Uh, they learn and teach, they uh, exchange uh, views with us. I mean, this is something that uh, as much as possible we have to try and bring uh, many more uh, Americans, uh, Russians, uh, Argentinians, French, any, any nationality to come and, and live in Israel for as long as they want. That will uh, be uh, a, great, uh, a great contribution to Israel and to themselves. You're still uh, excited when you see these guys happy, enjoying Israeli music? Every time, and especially now, because it's been, this is the first uh, big event that we did since COVID. It's actually the first international Jewish gathering, not just Massa, international Jewish gathering since COVID. And we, we are very excited. It's amazing to see them here and that they are so... Also that they're coming from 60 different countries. It's, uh, it's really, really unbelievable. And they see that they are part of a bigger thing. They are part of a global Jewish community and their connection is uh, the deeper the connection with Israel and also with other communities around the world.